What, what's more important, good sound or a good time? Sounding good, having a good time. I remember thinking maybe New York isn't the kind of city anymore that produces iconic bands. The Strokes launched a fireball. Started playing New York a year ago, and then tearing stuff up. A lot of people quit their jobs and just were like, I'm gonna play music full time. We felt like we were gonna take over the world. People went crazy for it. Suddenly, there were bands everywhere. It all happened so fast. <laughs> Team, go team. Let's team. Hey. Julian was telling me how scared he was. Things were never going to be normal for him again. Being a woman fronting a rock band, I was sensationalized. There was a lot of tension in the studio. He said, we really don't want people to hear this. But I've lived in fear my whole life, and I had nothing to lose. You could feel the love from the community. You could fail, and it didn't matter. It was about freedom. It became our home. Those years were the big bang of my life. You guys want to be in a documentary? <laughs>